This is the Red Village in Kuba, Azerbaijan. That's a mosque up there. This is a synagogue right here. We are all about unity. We are in this restaurant called Masari in Gabanga and this is our view. We are in the village of Kanale which is the highest point of all Azerbaijan. It is in UNESCO, for those of you who would like to get more information. And it is gorgeous. We just stopped on the way and there's so much animals along the way. There's donkeys, sheep, horses. We are at the memorial complex in Cuba. This is dedicated to all the Azeri people that have been attacked in the Armenian genocide and I'm going to show you further along this is all the genocide done by the Armenians this shows the faces and the tragedy in the people's eyes. This building is in the shape of two swords coming out of the ground and it's meant to represent that the truth cannot be hidden. So these are not actual graves, they're headstones to represent the people that were found on this land in a mass grave and they're done in size so the bigger ones represent the men these medium-sized ones here represent the women and the small ones represent all the children out of the 500 people that were found on this exact land a hundred of them were children and out of 50,000 people that were killed in this region 500 were found on this particular land and it was turned into this monument to represent them
at the alpaca farm in Shamaha, Azerbaijan. We are in Gebaram. Look at this beautiful place. They have restaurants all around. And then you have this gorgeous lake. You can get on these turtle boats. Beautiful, and you can sit out in one of these restaurants right on the lake. The water's pretty shallow. We are at the restaurant Gebele Hanlar, and this is considered one of the best restaurants if you are visiting Gebele. This is my first time here. I'm very excited to show you around. There's a lot of interesting things to take a look at. This is the entrance. This is really cool. It's Azerbaijani chai. It's spinning around. And we have some things here too. These are all the famous people that have visited. This is our president in Hamaliev. Several times actually here. Rest in paradise, one of our soldiers. Very interesting place. We have other souvenirs here. Everything is traditional. And here you have little private rooms that you can eat in. This is the name of the restaurant. Some of our kitchen. And we have a waterfall running right through. Wow, this is gorgeous. And this pathway takes you to other seating areas in the restaurant. This says the date today, the 17th of September, 2022. And they change it every day. It's a little fire here. So many cool things to see. They have Shisha getting ready over here.
so this here they put milk and it makes cheese and butter and then this well spins the chai what a beautiful dinner experience we are walking up the mountain called Diete Gyozel which means seven beauties The outskirts of Azerbaijan are so beautiful. This is on our way back. The water is crystal clear and it is so cold. This is the hotel that we stayed at last night. And this is the view. If you take the stairs up, it's absolutely beautiful. And he said this is at the very peak of the mountain. So there's about a five to six degree difference once you actually make it down into the city parts, which is also great for those who are dealing with asthma to come and breathe in the fresh air early in the morning. And this is at the very top. There's cable cards. People do come here to ski in the winter time, but we're about mid September now. This is where Wilderness <laughs> Cooking cooks. If some of you are familiar with his famous YouTube channel, he's also located in Gebele, Azerbaijan. This is the property where I think pretty much all the videos are made. And it's so nice. There's some chickens on the side there. There's beehives. Very inspiring. This is the view from beautiful Sheikh Marhal Palace. We have just arrived and we're going to be spending the night here. This is definitely better than the last hotel we stayed at. There's just more amenities and overall I like the look of this hotel better. We've already checked in. There's a slight difference between the rooms, not too much.
We're in the town of Kish, visiting one of the oldest Albanian churches. We're walking around the church. These are some of the grave sites found from the Albanians. And there's also people here that used to worship the moon even before them. These were found in some of the burials because they believed in afterlife and reincarnation. And candles used to be held up here with peacocks. <clears throat> they were known for their beauty and also um, for their flaws, so said not everything can be perfect. These are animal sacrifices from the Bronze Age. And here people put coins in the wall in hopes of their dreams coming true. <laughs> 